of your eubonics course. <laughs> I've been all ice. Group projects were a little frustrating because it was always a presentation by Steve Sonneveld featuring Jamal and introducing Little P, and it just it never worked. <laughs> and in midterm, the professor thought I was looking at someone else's paper. He said, Mr. Sonneveld, are you cheating? I said, no, I'm sampling. <laughs> surprised me because I felt fine. <laughs> now I thought that all you needed to learn to save someone from choking was C C R. <laughs> Turns out it's C P R. And I didn't realize this until I was at a restaurant and somebody started choking. So immediately I sprang into action. I jumped on that table and belted out a great rendition of Proud Mary. <laughs> Now, it wasn't until the fourth verse of my second encore <laughs> that someone pulled me aside and said, you're stepping on my bread. Did you get off my table? <laughs> now, luckily, the man who was choking died. <laughs> I say luckily because I almost ordered the same thing. <laughs> his wife was there, and obviously she was a little choked up. <laughs> oh, Not quite so permanent. I took Latin, which they say is the dead language. And no dead person I know speaks it, but whatever. I thought beta was the dead language. track. And every six months I need to upgrade this joke. But just this one, because I refuse to change the rest of my material. So I meant to speak easy. Says, you're such a dandy with the ladies. I said, bully, so forth. <laughs>